Welcome to Dollar Store Gaming. This is Rain Dancer. Normally 99 cents, purchased for 54. <laughs> I'm a little stunned. I paid 50 cents for this? It looks way better than that. It also has an incredible intro sequence. Look at this. I paid as much for this as I would for two gumballs? How? Not much else to do. Let's just let's just get into it. I plugged my controller in because this just seems, yep, like a controller game. Follow the path to discover your purpose. If only it worked that well in real life. Hmm, this bodes well. Wait, what was that? Whoa, what was that? Oh god, everything's confusing. Dash. Charge your attack to deal more damage. Okay, so we can tap. It, like, bounces back, though. Oh, I bet that's like a super hit. Yep, critical hit. 50% bonus damage. Aha! There you are. My rival stick thing. I love the animation. It's it's the kind of animation I'm pretty sure you can set it to just like auto generate in whatever program you're using, but it's kind of working. Although I'm getting serious Dark Soul vibes. Story mode and Tempest mode. Hmm. What? Oh god. Night Sandir! Fight me, coward! Oh. Okay. <clears throat> so this is very Dark Souls like. Dodge. Slice. Slice. Ow! Again, I'm a little shocked I paid so little for this game. I feel like it should be way more expensive given how it looks and how it's playing so far. Oh, he can dodge too! Uh, I finally made my match. No! <laughs> no! There we go. I'll absorb all his flower petals. Blessing absorbed. Oh! Body of the Bramble. Larger critical hit timing window. Oh, hey! That's neat. All right, let's go kill more things. It's like a twin stick melee game. One stick for movement, one stick for combat, and a dodge roll button. That's, that's all they need. Oh my god. Malvo, the first distiller. This is kind of badass. Whoa! Don't zoom out, I don't like this. Something horrible is about to happen. Well, it did, just not in the way I was expecting. Ready? Aim. Oh. oh, you jerk! I got... What's even the word for it? Waylaid by an arrow. Sure, let's go with that very strange sentence. Okay. <laughs> I need to be... Here's the thing, I'm terrible at Dark Souls. I played the first one for a couple hours and then realized I'd rather literally do anything else with my life. Which I kind of imagine is a lot of people's ex first experience with Dark Souls. Damn it! You know what, I want to check something really quick. I just need to see where this game came from. Rain Dancer game. Been around for almost a year. One hit deaths, made by a company called Strange Creatures Studio. And this is the only game they've made. And they've only tweeted like three times. And their website has expired. What? Where did this game come from? <laughs> Wonder how short the game is. Because looking at that, uh, that door we were at earlier, there were like four, um, dots to put things in. And we already had filled out one of them. I assume this is the second one we have to kill. It might just be a super short game. Yeah! Oh, that is so satisfying. Okay, let me just very quickly find the next boss. Oh, wow. This is a really pretty game. Banda, queen of all. Oh, cool. Oh, the music is sad now because I'm dead. So, the question is, is Rain Dancer worth a dollar? Absolutely. I'm stunned at this game. It looks nice. It plays really well. Seems like a pretty short game, but... You're more than getting your money's worth for how much you pay for it. I'm just surprised about the company. Maybe they just never went anywhere, sadly. Maybe the game just didn't get enough attention, even though it totally should. Maybe they all went on to better things, I hope. I really hope for that last one. This is the kind of game that gives me faith in doing dollar store gaming, which inevitably means next time I do it, it's gonna be some sort of asset flip piece of garbage, as most of them are.
Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe as I put out two new videos a week, Game Boy Roulette every Friday, and a brief look at Dollar Store Gaming or 10 Things You Missed every Monday. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time.